Hey everyone, it's your buddy Crypto Profit back with another video, and today we're going to be taking a quick look at Cardano ADA. We do see a $2.88 price point right now with a 2.9% increase in just the last 24 hours. Still a lot of volatility though. We saw actually a push all the way up to about 288, coming all the way back down to about 272 August 29th at 12.05 a.m. And then later in the day, we actually saw about 7.10 a.m. 294, now back down to 288, continuing to see, like I said, a lot of volatility in the Cardano ADA price point with a lot of big news coming up. Obviously, big dates ahead as well. September 12th being smart contracts, September 25th, 26th, more on the Summit 2021 for Cardano. There's, like I said, so much going on, and we're going to kind of cover all of the news and get into the nitty-gritty today in these articles as well. So the market cap right now continuing to rise, getting closer to $100 billion. We see a $93 billion market cap with the volume being right around $5.8 billion in the last 24 hours. If we actually take a look, though, Cardano ADA is a blockchain platform built on a proof-of-stake consensus protocol. Protocol. We've talked all about this before. We talked about what Cardano is, where it's going, and you know what they're trying to accomplish. So this ecosystem is continuing to grow. If we take a look at the last week, we do see about a 17.91% increase coming, like I said, all the way from 254 up to about 297, its all-time high, and then coming right back down to 247, back up to 295, back down to 275, and then back up to 294. So we are seeing a lot of movement. Like I said, a lot of volatility continuing to take place. The big thing to note, though, is we are still seeing about an 18 percent increase in this last week. The last month has been absolutely huge and massive for Cardano holders, seeing a 124 percent increase all the way from about a dollar twenty-eight, dollar twenty-nine range, pushing all the way, like I said, up to two dollars and eighty-eight cents. I do not think this is the you know the highest point we're going to get to. I think we're going to break three dollars before that smart contract state does you know come about. But I do want to jump into some of those prices or not those prices, but those updates and those news articles talking about Cardano. So let's get started. So the first tweet you're going to see is Cardano never fails to impress. I'll see you guys at $3 ADA. So this is actually from myself. So Crypto Profit YT on Twitter. If you guys aren't following me, definitely take the time to do so. I'll try to keep you guys up to date on Twitter as well as YouTube. So if you guys aren't subscribed already, make sure to quickly subscribe to the channel, turn notifications on and like the video as I try to keep you guys up to date with so many altcoins across the channel, whether it's Cardano, Chainlink, Polkadot, Stellar Lumens, you know, so much, like I said, out there that we want to keep you up to date with. So we also see Cardano ADA announced for smart contracts to be released September 12th, 2020, or sorry, 2021. Imagine where this brings us in 2022. So a lot of excitement for the future of Cardano, understanding that, you know, there's a lot of updates continuing to roll in. Here we see today, uh, by input output HK, by the way, um, you know, they're talking about Today, we have just submitted an upgrade proposal to the Cardano testnet to hard fork the chain into the Alonzo era and enable smart contract capability. This will take effect within the next few hours. And I wanted to kind of re-go over this. We you know, did do a video yesterday and talked about this, but uh, this is only August 27th, so just two days ago. And we saw that this is a major milestone and marks the final critical stage prior to hard forking the Cardano mainnet on target for September 12th. We also see over the days ahead, we will be doing final checks and testing within a controlled environment to ensure that we are ready to upgrade the main Cardano network and usher in a transformative era of smart contract capabilities. So I do want to jump into uh, you know a couple more tweets and then we'll jump into three different articles, some good articles regarding Cardano and the bullish outlook that we are getting. So here's a great tweet by Charles Hoskinson. Um, he says, moving the chain. So May 2021 um, versus August 2021. And you can see the absolute crazy um, difference here. I'm going to try to give you guys a full overview of this is May. Uh, but let me go over to the next one. Now this is going to be August. And obviously a ton of projects jumped on board in August and uh, or, you know, up to up until this August date. It's just crazy to see this ecosystem continue to grow and rise as fast as it is. I do want to jump into a couple more tweets. So we also see, and we thought that they'd be only supporting 20 local meetup events. It looks like Cardano actually is going to be supporting 40 meetup events. That's quite a bit of events obviously going to be held. It's going to give a lot of retail investors some love on Cardano, in my opinion. I think we're going to see a lot of people jumping on board, institutional investors as well, understanding the path that retail investors are taking to actually grab a hold of Cardano ADA on the way up. And I think this is going to be extraordinary obviously like you, like i said smart contracts will be released at this point we're gonna have a lot to talk about regarding cardano so it's gonna be a great time i do want to take a look at this as well so it talks about cardano summit australia when the aussies say they're serious about cardano as my phone kind of went off i'll put my phone a little bit lower there uh when the aussies say they're serious about cardano they mean it 50 or sorry 500 plus registered interest spos plutus pioneers and creators sydney perth brisbane adelaide 
uh, you know, most volunteer hosts from one country. So it's just insane. The Australia support is crazy, it sounds like. And, you know, that's one thing to note is we are continuing to get a ton of support from a lot of different places, which is just absolutely amazing for Cardano holders. We see making education in Africa more accessible, affordable, and equitable. So this was actually back in August 23rd. I just want to kind of re-go over this in case you missed it, because announcing a new strategic partnership between IOHK and the European Business University of Luxembourg is a big deal. It's just kind of getting tucked under, uh, you know, with smart contracts coming. A lot of people talking more about the hard fork, the Cardano Summit, and smart contracts, and they kind of skipped over this. And I want to make sure we all saw this, you know, widening the, widening the reach of education in Africa is obviously very, very important. And Cardano is kind of leading that charge, which is absolutely great. And I, I want to talk a little bit more about these next two articles. So this one specifically talking about Cardano continues staggering climb, becomes the third largest crypto. And we've seen this for a while now. Cardano, a cryptocurrency that was largely unknown at the start of the year for many, many people, has powered its way to become the third largest crypto on the market. The digital coin hit an all-time high Friday, $2.50 or $2.50 cents, I should say, a jump of more than 18% year to date and has seen a returns of 1,294% according to Coindesk. So that's absolutely huge. You know, I'm not going to read too much more into this. You guys know about this Cardano push up. We saw all kind of been watching it take place. Absolutely massive. And I want to take a look at the very last article before we jump into price predictions for the end of the year and the end of the bull market bar two. We see best cryptocurrency 2021 top performing crypto coins, Bitcoin and Dogecoin price. And is it safe to invest? So obviously they just love putting Dogecoin in. Uh, I think it gets a lot of clicks or something. So they continue to throw Dogecoin in with a lot of these titles but i will say you know when they talk about bitcoin and dogecoin prices uh it's it's great to see you know more talk about cardano in here and you know it's funny they can't really get away from cardano the green uh you know safe coin so here a self-proclaimed green cryptocurrency cardano has somewhat weathered the storm bought on the environment concerns spoken about by tesla ceo elon musk its founder charles hoskinson estimates the cardano's entire system uses less than 0.01 percent of the energy consumed by bitcoin's network in controversial mining process and as a result has seen a 40.11 increase over the past week and a 125 percent increase in its value over the past month so obviously massive increases we've talked about that already i'm not going to go details into that but it's great to see you know articles talking about the best performing crypto coins they start with bitcoin and dogecoin but, you know, Cardano is sounding very, very good. And I think, you know, the tides are going to turn. I think a lot of people are going to start talking more about Cardano. We saw um, in our last video, we did a little comparison of Cardano and Ethereum on Google searches. And we actually saw Cardano was actually starting to almost pass Ethereum in searches. And it was, uh, you know, not even close just a month or two ago. So smart contracts really starting to put a name out for themselves. I think we are going to see this ecosystem continue to grow very, very quickly with new projects, definitely wanting to jump on board with, you know, this new really profound fame, you know, a lot of people talking about Cardano every single day. Um, you know, this channel has been talking about Cardano since, you know, a dollar, but realistically, or actually it was less than a dollar when we started talking about Cardano, but it's great to see this, you know, like I said, big things happening for Cardano as we continue to push up. I do want to talk though, like I said, by the end of the year, we could easily see Cardano pushing to that three to five dollar price point, I'm not changing much here on the price predictions. I'm sure they will change in the next couple of weeks, depending on what happens with the, uh, you know, sell the news, uh, you know, buy the hype. I think a lot of people are continuing with that method of buying the hype and we'll see what happens after smart contracts are released. I think because of, you know, how much staking is taking place, we're not going to see as massive as a dip, um, you know, that we, I guess are kind of used to on this buying the hype and selling the news. But I think realistically, I'm not selling anything, uh, most likely not much at, at the very least uh, on, on that date or before that date. Um, realistically, I'm going to continue to hold, continue to stake, continue to earn passive income. I do believe that Cardano is going to be here for a long time to come. That's definitely a coin I believe in the future. Uh, you know, utility wise, it's going to continue to build. I do, like I said, think by the end of the bull market part two, we're going to see a seven to $10 price point on Cardano at the very, very least. We're continuing to climb very, very quickly. Market cap at $93 billion. Obviously, the crypto space is going to need more liquidity. We're going to need more funds coming in. So retail as well as institutional investors may be the ones to actually pump Cardano, obviously, up to that seven to $10 range, but it's definitely within reach. So that's my price prediction. I will say, guys, I'm not a financial advisor, so always do your own research before investing. And there's a lot of reasons as to why you want a dollar cost average in during dips and not at the top of these market runs if you guys you know if you would have taken advantage of these dips you would have got a 248 dollar or two dollars and 47 dollar price point 250 at the very least and you would have saw a nice rise or a nice profit already you would have saw the same thing on this left side you would have saw the same thing here on 264 264 you know you have a ton of possibilities a ton of different uh you know options when it comes to buying that dip you know in the last week we've had 
you know, plenty of dips for you to buy. So just try not to buy those green candles. It's much, much easier to buy the dips. So thank you guys again for tuning in. If you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, let me know in the comment section down below. If you guys haven't already, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel and turn notifications on. I do have a Patreon down in the description below. If you guys want to take a look, I give you really low market cap picks, ICOs, pre-sales. I give you guys all those great opportunities before they go out into video form. So thanks again, guys, for tuning in. I'll see you all in the next one.